Hello everyone. So I have 111 subscribers and I wanted to do a giveaway. So this is what I was working on. Um, this is like a traveler's notebook size journal. And the image is from the Undercliff by uh, Elaine Franks. This is the book that Izzy B always uses and I got one on eBay because I love the images. So I tried one of these out. Uh, I tried really hard to make it not too much like Izzy B's because they're so wonderful. Um, and it's not completely finished, but this will be the, um, the giveaway item. So it is a traveler's notebook sized journal and it has the image on the front. It has a sorry silk closure with two of the Tim Holtz flat, um, what are these called? Eyelets and it has a sorry silk um, reinforcement of the binding and a three hole pamphlet stitch on the edge. And this is a little charm with some acorns for the cute little dormouse. On the inside there is um, fabric um, on covering the inside with uh, sewn in pockets and each of those pockets has a card. This one has another undercliff illustration with ledger paper on the back. I'm including a flat pen and it's got like a cardstock folder on the inside as well. So this is the inside. It's pretty straightforward and simple right now. This is a guest check on the back of this one. This is actually from um, Edith Holden, um, but it's a, an Edith Holden book that I got at a uh, library book sale and it came in this purple cover. Oops, sorry. Mm, sorry. Um, purple cover and the pages were much newer. I think it's a much newer print of it. Um, so they're kind of crisp and they have this kind of pinkish lavender tinge to them. Kind of interesting. I'm enjoying it. The, the, um, the weight is a little bit heavier than some of the other Edith Holden um, books that I have. Sorry my desk is such a mess. So it's got some pages. This is one of those Edith Holden papers. It's almost like a little bit of a cardstock. Um, some more writing pages and this has some encyclopedia pages and this is just uh, Tim Holtz card. I think I'll embellish this a little bit more but I have to run out and I really wanted to get this up on um, YouTube. So here's another uh, deer mouse, grasshopper mouse encyclopedia page. Here is um, another journaling card. And this is kind of cool. This is from a National Audubon Encyclopedia and it has footprint identifications. And on the ends of the strings, I've, um, I have some beads and some, some charms. I threaded the thread through the beads around the charm and back through. It's kind of a struggle, but I'm happy with how the, that came out another thin journaling tag card with some fussy cut cardstock from a paper pad that I bought. Harvest Mouse, more journaling pages, Magpie from the Hammond's Nature Atlas, Black Cat Chickadee, more journaling pages, the other side of that Edith Holden paper and the back of the folder has a tag. Am I in frame? So hard. I love that image with the little barn swallows. It's time of year, they're all out and about. And the back pocket has uh, another Edith Holden. So that is the back. That's another undercliff. And it just ties up. So. Uh, as I say, I may wind up embellishing it a bit more as I play. And this is going to be my 111 subscriber giveaway. So what do I want you to do for the giveaway? Could you please make sure you are, you've subscribed? Please make sure you've liked this video. And please leave a comment that tells me something about how you enjoy junk journals. Do you like making them? Do you use them to write in? Do you um, collect them? Um, do you like using journaling tags? What kind of things do you keep track of? 
So let's have a conversation about that. So once again, happy 111 subscribers and have a great day. Bye.